Hey, so the question that often hits me is, what do you do when you're in it? Like everyone knows what this is, right? Whether you're a single mom, whether you're an entrepreneur, whether you're just a human walking planet Earth, like sometimes you are just in it. You're in the thick of chaos and confusion and overwhelm and anxiety and stress, depression, or you're just this, the, the like the full pressure of, of modern day life and all that that's brings on us like what do you what do you do when you're in the middle of it and and sometimes it's hard to even talk about when you're in the thick of it because it's easier to it's you know I found this especially in the entrepreneur world we want to talk about when we have the big wins we we've made the big sale uh whether it's in business or sales starting your own business entrepreneur stuff uh you, you know we want to talk about it's it's more comfortable to talk about the past like oh man this these are the lessons I've learned from past failures or these are the these are the, man. This was a really hard time I went through, and this is how I crushed it, or or came through at the end. But in the moment, in the present, it's really hard to talk about. Like, what do you do when you're just in it? And uh, and so right now, I've been building a business the last six months, and I'm in it. But it's it's a part of the journey. And so there's what I love. I was reading this book uh, called U Squared by Price Pritchett, my business coach, Myra Golden recommended it to me. And it's a, it's a really short, I have it on the counter over there or on the bookshelf, but it's a really short book. It's like 40 pages long, but basically there's a chunk. So you, Price Pritchett talks about when you, like you squared, so the formula, right? When you're going to, when you're going to exponentially grow and, and have a quantum leap in your life. So you're going from where you are and you're leaping to where you want to be. He said, there's right, that quantum leap, he'll say you're, you're prepared right now for the season in your life to make this quantum leap. You've been preparing your whole life for this moment to make that leap. But he said, you know, when you make that leap, you're 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 floating in the air. You have left the place of certainty, the place of comfort, the place of peace, and you're going to a new place. This new place is unknown. And so with that new leap into the unknown comes uncertainty and overwhelm and chaos and confusion and anxiety. So he said, you know, just because you have taken massive action and there's chaos and confusion and anxiety in your world doesn't necessarily mean that you're making a mistake, that you're doing something wrong, that you're failing. It actually could mean you're in the very middle of of the leap. So I don't know if that's true, but it brings me comfort. It brings me encouragement. It brings me hope. And so uh, that's my heart is that you guys would be encouraged. Um if if you're going through it, if you are in it right now, and you maybe you're a single mom, maybe you're an entrepreneur starting your own business alone, but you are feeling overwhelmed in the in the sheer enormity and immensity of the tasks at hand, and you're feeling for the entrepreneurs, you're feeling like, man, I've got to learn sales and marketing and systems, and I've got to become disciplined and focused, and man, I procrastinate. And last night I looked, I fell into a YouTube hole for three hours. Maybe this video is a part of your YouTube poll. I don't know uh, that you know that 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 spiral. Uh, take heart, take heart. Uh, I find that there is like like what Price Pritchett said. I find that there's hope, and when we're in the middle of overwhelming anxiety, uh, there's hope. Tomorrow's a new day, and I've found that. I'm not. Always, I'm not. This, I. I often find like you know. I'm not the smartest out there. I'm not. I'm not the. I don't know. I'm, I'm not any of the things that the strongest, the smartest, the most brilliant. But what I found is, hey, I could take a beating and get back up and hit it tomorrow. Sometimes, like you know what, I went down this YouTube hole for three hours, or man, I just totally procrastinated the things that I got done, or man, all these distractions things came in last minute tasks and i had to take care of other things um but you know tomorrow's a new day and so let go of yesterday let go of the past and know that you got this you got this thing all right we'll talk soon